Hi, this tutorial is going to be about virtual box and firmware and all that. We are working on I, um, i3wm on Linux Mint, as you can see. And we want to change the config file so that all that's virtual is going to be on Workspace 7. So every uh, program has its own workspace in my view. And one is, is all that's browsers, two is all that's text editing and coding and so on. And it's all defined in the config file in i3. So now I will show you how to figure out what the name is of these programs, VirtualBox, VMware and so on, and how to put it in your config. Okay, let's uh, get rid of this. Um, we have only this open. Let's go and do the first thing. So Windows D, Super D is VM player. In one of the movies, the tutorials, we installed VMware player on kernel 3, uh, sorry, uh, 4.9.5, that's the kernel. And I think I mistyped here, VM player. That's the one we need. It's going to open and I really would like it to open at some specific place. So now it's opening here at 6. I've opened it twice now. So it's opening at 6 and I would rather have it open at 7. So how do I do that? We installed Antergos on this uh, VMware uh, VM player. But that, like I said, it's more an i3 tutorial. So we do Windows Enter. So we get a terminal, we type in xprop, give me the properties of this x here. And then we can shut down VMware player, we don't need it. We just wanted to know what is the class string. And this is the name, VM player, with a capital V. I'm gonna copy it. And then we're gonna close this one. And we want to have i3, config file, in sublime text scroll all the way down on till somewhere here um, pop, 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 pop. no back up again no 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 more up more upper upper than this so here is my assign section telling him go to workspace 1, go to workspace 2 and so on. Here I want to add workspace 6 and like you see I've already added here the VM player and the virtual box. So that's what you have to do. Find the X properties, assign class and then via VM player and this is a piping which on Azerti is on all GR1. So I'm lying. And VirtualBox is not yet installed. I really don't know if that's the proper name. So I'm gonna tell him not to go to 6 but to go to 7 because 6 is already taken for VLC as you can see. So VMware player and the VirtualBox will go to 7. I'm gonna save this. You could reload it already. Windows Shift R and then now he knows he should go to 7. We could test that of course. Why not? So Windows T, VM player, enter and wait. There you see, 7 has come up here. It's a rather big program to start. And a winter landscape for from a variety. Didn't change it every five minutes or so. I got a wallpaper, now I am changing it. This I'm gonna trash, I don't like it, this I like, so let it be. There we are, it's loaded, let's kill it again. Okay, next up, I, it's a clean installation, so I don't have virtual box yet, so I'm going to my GitHub, Eric Dubois uh, GitHub, so you go to https github.com, Eric Dubois, and then we have Ultimate Linux Mint 18.1 Cinnamon. Somewhere in this thing here, in this list here, is the VirtualBox script. You run it. 
you type in your password and we're getting the latest 5.1.12 okay why am I installing it because I don't know if xprop is correct I just that was just my guess so you really have to install it and then you can go ahead so I'm gonna try Windows D virtual box here you go blah 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 has been released it's available there is a newer version already available I can update my script I'll do that in a bit what I do now is Windows enter same procedure X properties move over to the window with my cursor here and wait kill this one oops wrong one again xprop and I want to kill this one and now we're gonna look and it it's it's wrong it, I've written it wrong the B should be capital it's really important that everything is in order so virtual box would be wrong wouldn't have worked but now it will work we save it and that's how you assign a program to some kind of uh, workspace have fun using i3